All right, guys, so here it is, the Pixel 4, the most leaked phone basically ever. So there's nothing here I'm going to be able to tell you that's a surprise to anyone because you've already probably seen it on the Internet. But what I can tell you that you probably haven't experienced is what it looks like and what it feels like to have the phone actually in front of you and in the hand. And overall, I mean, the build quality of the thing is just great. Uh, the, the soft touch back feels awesome. Um, you've got this kind of grip around the sides that just gives it a unique look and a unique feel accented power button you know like they've done and most you know pixel devices that have come out so some pretty cool stuff going on here the 90 Hertz display delivers uh, just like they said in the keynote you know this thing has the best possible rating on display so colors look awesome viewing angles look awesome brightness looks awesome and this 90 Hertz even though we've seen it on other devices before is it very much a welcome addition to the pixel family I mean it's awesome to be able to see that kind of refresh rate and I'm I'm for one I'm going to be glad to be you know getting used to using a device that has a refresh rate like this but other than that guys there's not a ton to talk about with this device other than project solely we can't set up face unlock I'm not going to put my Google account on here but they said with solely it knows when you're reaching for it it knows when you bring the phone up to your face and so it's already ready to unlock right away but then once we have say YouTube music going you can just swipe through and you can kind of see that glow you see it glowing at the top of the screen it knows that I'm close and then you can see the glow follow my hand to know that it picked up the gesture so it, you can tell it knows when your hands close you see the glow down here and you can see it follow my hand as I swipe left or swipe right swipe left and you can move through tracks in any app that supports this kind of interface obviously this is going to do a lot more than just this we're talking fine details of being able to kind of twist and turn and do this kind of stuff but for right now you're just doing basic motion controls and then it's able to know that someone's close you're going to pick the phone up so you can see it glowing more so that it knows to turn on things like face unlock when it's time to actually unlock the phone but guys really that's it I mean again there's nothing I can tell you about this device that you didn't already know. Google did launch this voice recorder app that is going to be on all kinds of stuff. It's not just for this phone, but it actually transcribes your voice recordings in real time for you. But in general, it's a Pixel phone, awesome display, great build quality, and probably, again, the best camera. But until other reviewers get their hands on it, we get our hands on it, it's hard to know exactly how good this thing's going to match up against something like the iPhone 11. But we're hopeful with all the stuff Google's added from a software standpoint that this thing is going to stand up and be an awesome performer in the camera market again this year. And guys, that's it for this one. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up button, hit that subscribe button. And until next time, we'll see you.